ladies and gentlemen, the Anointed One, a.k.a. Fragrance King. What's up, everybody? I have in my hands my favorite Boss fragrance, Boss Bottled EDP. Just got this in the mail. Now I sprayed it on me as soon as it came out, many a couple years ago. And I sat with it on a fall day. And I know that I liked it. And I haven't smelled it since. I think I smelled it in the mall on some cards since, but I had a dream about it. And so I ordered it. Um, so I'm going to hit myself with this and give it a review on it. Sit with it all night. And I remember there's all kinds of reviews. This is the poor man's late ton. All kinds of stuff, but I remember I, I remember I love this. I love this. So we'll see if I still do. I think it's a cardamom bomb. It reminded me of something good. So that was the fall time when it came out, so it's spring. Let's do it. Brand new bottle. So, it is a sweet cardamom, that's what I'm getting, like, a sweet, not sugary sweet, but it's that boss, they got, they're known for the apple pie DNA. So this is a sweet cardamom so far. I remember it burning down in something that was that's good. So, off the first spray. So this is basically what not my first impressions, but the second wearing revisit. We'll call it a revisiting. So, got the bottle, had the dream. This stuff's good, and yeah, I like it. Is it a bit generic? It's um, it's 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 not wowing me. It's not wowing me, but let's let it sit down. Let's let it sit sit on my skin for a while. So we'll see what it's like in seven hours. But it's pretty pretty good. It's the best boss. I know that. I, mean, I think it's the best boss. Everything that I smell. All right, I'll be back in uh, six seven hours with some more what's up everybody back sitting with this boss bottle edp about six and a half hours in and i love this stuff uh, i'm still projecting pretty good off my skin and i can just i'm just i'm just getting wafts of it off my my neck i put the sweatshirt on for work and covered up the shirt that i sprayed on i didn't even hit myself 10 times so it's projecting crazy for two hours and i'm Still, like, got a nice sand bubble, slight projection, six and a half hours in. So this EDP, it, it performs. And I love this stuff. So it's not the poor man's Layton. It's, it's, it, it does have performance. And so what I get out of this is just this spice, this cardamom, basically. Sweet, a sweet cardamom. That's not. It's if it was any sweeter, it'd be approaching candied. But it's like spice, and then the sweetness comes second to it, and then you get kind of a fresh dryer sheet, kind of a smell to it too. So, fresh dryer sheet, sweet cardamom spice. It just radiates evenly, and it's a well balanced. There's nothing. There's no sharp edges, and it just. It's like a nice, nice. It's not approaching gourmand or too candied sweet. And I think it's just like a, it's just a good spice cardamom, like a date fragrance even. Like real good, freshy, sweet date spice fragrance that performs. So, so Boss's website has the good notes. For granted, it doesn't have the right notes. And basically here, on the top, they're supposed to have this apple accord that Boss is known for. But it's 
a bergamot bright citrus and light floral notes join the apple accord of the original boss bottle clary sage extract winds the floral faucets and black pepper essence from madagascar lends a spicy contrast so right there the bergamot the sage extract and then the black pepper that's the top the middle it's uh basically uh Green cardamom extract, chestnut, nutmeg oil, and cinnamon with some sage as well. And um, that's basically rounding the spices up. That cardamom extract, that nutmeg oil, the cinnamon. I don't get any chestnut. There's no chestnut to me. It just does not smell like Armani Stronger With You. And so it's like that pepper, nutmeg oil, cardamom extract cinnamon the cinnamon's not poking through like i don't really get any distinct cinnamon it's just kind of like a well blended spice and the only thing that pops out to me is that cardamom extract and in the base they just say musk and dark vetiver evolving on the skin to deliver leathery and smoky finish with developing woody notes so it's all blended smooth no sharp edges to this and it's just like what i said it's that cardamom nutmeg oil spice it's just got that sweetness underneath it it's got some kind of a freshness to it as well and it, it's pretty good and it lasts and performs so boss bottle edp it's my it's my favorite out of the line for sure out of all the boss bottles that i've smelled so had to get this one doing a review on it I would recommend it. I got a tester from Drama Shop for forty-two bucks, and I didn't want to go to—I didn't want to get a huge bottle, but that was the cheapest, around forty-two bucks for a tester. I wanted to get a smaller one, but I had fragrance net it's still like forty bucks for the small one. So that's what I got. This performs, and I think that it's the best in the fall. That's when I—that's when I first smelled it in twenty twenty. It's in the fall, so I would recommend this for the fall. But I just had it on me for this nice spring day and it was okay it, just, it, def it definitely reminds me of some kind of fall fall atmosphere but uh, I'd say the more heat you put on this the more it's going to project so summertime I don't know I'm going to try it throughout the whole year and it's just going to be my this might be my date fragrance for real this might be my date fragrance we'll see it's good it's good that's for sure but all right that's boss bottle adp like comment subscribe if you want let me know what you guys think thanks for watching i hope this helps somebody out i'm out ladies and gentlemen the anointed one aka fragrance king